Hi, it's Steve. Today we'd like to show you how to change the rear drawer glide on your range. It's a really easy repair. Let me show you how we do it. Now to change the rear drawer glide on this range, we're going to start by pulling open that drawer, removing any items that may be in the drawer, and then we'll take the drawer completely out of the range, pull it out until it comes up against the stops, lift up on it, and then slide it out. Now if the defective slide is still on that drawer, we simply need to remove the retaining screw. The screw is either a number one square head or a quarter inch hex head uh, nut grabber. We'll remove it. Now if the glide is still attached to that drawer, we will need to take a pair of needle nose pliers and just squeeze that retaining tab together and pop it out through the back side. You can then discard the old one. Now when installing the new one, we want to make sure that we line up that little arrowhead fastener, as well as the there's an elongated tab on the bottom. We'll fit that into the slot on the outside edge of the drawer. Slot close to the bottom. We'll engage that tab, just pivot it around, and then push that arrowhead fastener through the rectangular hole above it, press it into place, and we'll secure it with the retaining screw from the inside. Now as well, you'll want to put a little bit of food grade lubricant on that slide. And now we're ready to reinstall it in the range. We'll begin by lifting it up into place and making sure that the stops on the top of that drawer go in past the front glides. Let the rear glides engage the track on the bottom. Slide it in past the stops. And you should not be able to tilt that drawer forward. If you can, that means that the bottom glides did not engage. Once we've done that, we simply need to push the drawer back into place. Now that the drawer slides easily again, we can put our items back in it and your repair is complete.